So Adam, from the standpoint of business today, how do you think the summit went? Uh, do you think businesses will be pleased with what they've heard today, or do you think it will be kind of uh, more of the same? Well, I, I think it's, to be honest, one of the biggest things that's important is that for businesses that they have that now all of a sudden more Albertans have an understanding of the true fiscal realities that we're facing in the sense that what's driving uh, our low provincial revenues, the true financial and fiscal situation that we're in. And so as soon as you get that on the table, more Albertans understand the importance of particularly the energy sector to this economy and the need for us to, whether it's pipeline access or labor issues, all of these things are important for business. And so if more Albertans understand that and get behind the sector, they can benefit. And so you think that uh, that understanding kind of is the key the key um, thing that came out of the uh, that came out of the, the summit today that Albertans are getting to know, getting to understand that kind of what's what's involved in making these decisions and what's involved in kind of you know, making the economy grow. Absolutely. I think part of it is is that we have to make sure that Albertans understand the, the situation. And so we can't have conversations around, geez, do we want to have a sales tax or what areas do we want to cut if people don't understand the full context and the realities that we're facing right now. So I think education was a key part of that today. Uh, I also think that some great ideas were put forward. Not a lot of them are new. It's a matter of fact that let's actually... Uh, begin to have um, that dialogue that we created today and move forward with some of the ideas so we can actually begin to get out of the situation.